I'm Ailey McNichol and I am a straight PhD student doing a PhD in neuroimaging research. My project uh, studies interactions between macrophages and mesenchymal stromal cells in the tumour microenvironment. I'm investigating the genetic architecture of a rare disease called orofacial ganglionomatosis. My project specifically looks into the development of new antiarrhythmic uh, drugs. Before I joined the MRC DTP, I uh, did an undergraduate degree in biochemistry. A BSc in neuroscience. Then uh, a master's in immunology. A master's in prenatal genetics and fetal medicine. My MSc in neuroimaging. An MRes in biomedical and molecular sciences research. I chose the straight PhD pathway because I had already done a research master's before and I had a pretty well-defined idea of what I wanted to do and the straight PhD pathway gave me a bit more freedom to explore within my project. I chose the MRC DTP because it offers a unique program structure where you can not only develop your research skills but you can develop transferable skills alongside that. It was the only program that offered a wider development opportunities. The flexibility that's available, the different courses uh, were very broad, which reflects the cohort, which is really great for perspective. Working alongside bench scientists is really important when you're focusing on something so large scale as brain anatomy. The ability to interact with biomedical research students uh, from neuroscience, from psychology, immunology and clinical research, I think that's something that uh, is not as common. The training programme is very broad and that was really great for me. What was really useful was learning more about the skills that other people use or that I could use in conjunction with my neuroimaging. I applied for the MRC Flexible Supplement Fund um, which allowed me to go on a high dimensional analysis training program for flow cytometry. Um, and the, the flexible supplement was great because if I hadn't received it I probably wouldn't have been able to attend this course and the training that it provided me allowed me to um, open up new avenues to pursue within my research project. My cohort decided that we'd like to set up a social committee. We organise activities for the entire cohort, including some of our partner programmes. The most recent events that we've done have been a pub quiz, which we've organised for the cohort. We've also done a beer and brainstorm, which involves getting some of the students to present some of their work. We have banded together to start a public engagement group. We're all really enthusiastic to try and display our science to the general public in a way that can help engage people better. I would recommend the DTP program because of its unique structure and the fact that you get to learn skills such as transferable skills uh, whilst also doing your PhD. It also has this dual entry structure where if you are unsure of the exact discipline with which you want to study your PhD, it provides uh, a lot of time to try a lot of different labs, a lot of different research projects. The variety of backgrounds and personalities in the cohort, that's really its strength because um, there's always something really refreshing about sharing your science with someone else who is not necessarily in the same field as you. The DTP is an excellent program to study a PhD. Mm -hmm.